Yo yo yo, what is going on guys? It is a man bad place, right back at you with another video of Wolf Among Us. So let's continue where we left off. Uh, you know, let's get to the woodlands. I don't know what is it called already. Apartment or something. Yeah, let's let's get this thing done. So let's check this out. What do we have here? Luxury apartment. Wish they wouldn't advertise that. <laughs> Big B, straight up. Thought he walks though. Pretty crazy though. There's no walking on the grass. No white's orders. I'll be sure to send her an apology. Beauty. Hello, Big B. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little. Right, why did you hide? Why'd you hide when I walked up? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. No, you can't. Oh, she definitely can't. I'm late. Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. All right, all right, all right. I promise. I promise on that. You Don't promise? worry too much. I promise. Thank you, Bigby. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. Of course. <laughs> Thank you for trusting me. Really, I. I appreciate it, Bigby. Well, don't mention it. Slightly cop knocked out the usual. Controls are a bit of hmm. Let's see. Let's check out is there any mail for me? Been a while since I got any mail. Seventh day in a row. Still nothing. Okay, uh let's let's let's, let's call for the elevator bro. So anyways guys, um, how are you holding on with this series? Do you feel it's good or is it like you need more action or something like that? Well anyways, anyways, if you feel like uh, it's good, you know, please do let me know in the comment section below. Bigby, hey, wait up. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Nope. I haven't seen, seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. So, <clears throat> guys, this is actually based on a book, if I'm not mistaken. Called Fables as well. So, but it's not Wolf Among Us. It's called Fables, but... I mean, if it's... I'm not I'm not sure because I have not read the book yet, but I gotta say the story of this game from episode one to five is pretty amazing. And I don't know why it does that. Damn, should have cracked a window. I like how they did, did the character out of him, whereby, you know, he was the big bad wolf before and now he's like, protecting other people. Damn it. 
it's like more responsibilities on him as a detective. If I'm not mistaken, it's a detective or something. Let's check this shit out. Let's check this shit out. Here's file. I mean, you never know. There's some good information right there, right? Never trusted this guy. <laughs> oh, blue beard. I think I remember you. I just like you know I things. Things are coming to my mind really as well because it's been a long time since I have played this game and it's you know it's fucking amazing. Should help. All right, it's <laughs> and. Oh, hey, Big B. I'm in your chair, huh? All right, come on, I'm tired. I'm tired, Colin. It's been a long day. Oh, that's the picture there. Uh, Red Riding Hood. Got a smoke? Damn. Big that smokes. Thanks. Really crazy about that. Couple thousand more of these will be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. I can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Calm down. I'm not sending you back. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. If that was all you were saying, I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. I'm doing my best here. Clearly that is not true. What with the selfishness with the bourbon. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables? Sometimes I take them to the farm. Fuck you. <laughs> You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad? Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. Since when it's not. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Name one. Oh, you. beauty. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I told her I'd lie for her. Right. Yeah. That's real nice of you. Real sarcastic of you, call it. Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. No cap on that. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't Just make sense. Just give me a drink, please. Colin, <laughs> enough already. I 
haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut-eye before I... Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. I'll give you the drink, man. I'll be a nice guy a bit, you know. But in this playthrough, I'm not going to be the... I'm gonna be half half on it because on the last time I played this game I was a few years ago I played a nice big B you know but this one I'm gonna play half half you know as Mass Effect would say Renegade and Paragon <laughs> I wonder who it is let's go Jeez, calm down. I'm coming, I'm coming. Big B! Snow? Come with me. What the hell just happened? Wait. Snow. I, Snow! What? I already know, so... I'm not gonna spoil it for you guys if you're just first time watching it. What is it? Slow just down. Slow down. No. Keep up. We need to... Hi. Hello. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> yeah. You know there was a conspiracy theory on this guy we just saw? These but walls are paper thin. I won't review it later in the game. be careful. We'll talk outside. Bloody hell. No. Fucked up. You knew this girl? Is she's not a Mundy, right? Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. She looks familiar. A working girl? A working girl? I don't I mean, I'm a working oh. Yeah. Get that on it. The woodsman. He attacked her and I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's Bloody just... How. Terrible. Do you see anyone, though? So, did you see anyone else? No. No one. No cabs, no voices, Mondays? Maybe, but... No. I don't think so. I would remember. Okay. Big P, did one of... us... do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. Yeah, indefinitely. I'll have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. It's fucked up, guys. Seriously. Uh, this, this, you know. Strange cut. What did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp, or something with magic attached to it. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. What kind of monster would do this? I do not know, Snow. I do not know. What is... 
It's legitly messed up, man. It's a ribbon. There's some kind of symbol here. Hmm. I I don't recognize it. Neither do I. I'm sorry. This is just so surreal. <sighs> um, what... what do you want to do next? Investigate more. Have some time. Definitely investigate more. Investigating the area. Okay, good idea. Can I see what... Can we... Can we do? Is there's blood trail there, so... Blood. Drops of blood. I'd say it's been here an hour, maybe. Yeah. Let's follow the trail, blood. All right, we have another clue. Fabric looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. Nothing really can say from that. Just some loose trash. And there's some extra blood, so we might have pierced through this thing. Still wet. Sharp enough. Hmm. I think that's it, what you can see from here itself. But yeah, we can go to the other side and you know, check the shit out of it. Let's see, do we have anything on this side in particular where we can. I still feel weird about the controls a bit, so sorry guys, still getting used to it. I'm not so used to the controls here yet. Because I'm currently using a, oh I can't go here. I'm currently using a mouse and keyboard to play, so it's a bit slightly harder to play on it. Still getting used to it. Let's see. What are you doing? Better to be thorough. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much time. We should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? How did this happen? Someone brought her here, man. Her. Someone brought her in from the outside. That makes sense. There's no signs of a struggle. But how do you know? I found fence. blood on the fence back there. Someone hopped over. Okay, good. That's solid. So, someone from the outside. Well, at least they didn't come from inside the woodlands. It's hard to say, you know. I'm gonna have to tell Crane about this. <sighs> it could be as long Crane. as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway, so we may as well get out in front of it. It'll just be worse if you do finds what you need to do. Him. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Hopefully, he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. <sighs> I'm not. I just don't want him interfering. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. You want me to take a hit there? Alright. Sure. No one thinks it's that obvious. Am I right? Is he? This guy's here again. So you know. What are you, you know, blind? It is. What? You don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I know. I'm taking cuts. Is that supposed to be funny? You see anyone here laughing, sheriff? Oh, fuck you for being salty, bruh. Fucker. Because you are 
the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Yes, of course I Don't do. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly yeah, around gonna here. Say no one this to is a disaster. It isn't anyone's fault. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, is that how you see things? Of course. Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Uh, I see the woodsman. woodsman is a person of interest. From what we've been able to gather, he was last seen with the victim. The woodsman? That drunk wretch was the cause of this? It's a lead. Nothing's certain yet. Well, find him. Get him in here if that's all you have to go on. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. Yes? Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Massage Where is the bottle of wine oh. you were to purchase? <laughs> Don't bother. Forget it. Can't do anything right. Do your job, Sheriff. Or we'll find someone who can. Oh, fuck you. You know what? Stop. We'll get on it right away, sir. You would have just pissed him off more. All right. Well, that could have gone better. Well, maybe we should have dragged it out. For what it's worth, I still think it was better to tell him. Yeah, maybe. Oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking and... Never mind. Smoke away. Yeah, he gets a morning massage. Gets a massage this early. Crane. It doesn't really matter the time of day. The mere <laughs> scent of stress, and he's out the door. Is Jeez, man. Is he gone? Like, yes, really? Hopefully. Oh. And this guy is the one who stole his drink. Freaking drunk it. <laughs> Sorry. Buffkin! Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Doesn't even know. Maybe. <laughs> hey. Like, really? How are you today, Mr. Bigby? Oh. Yeah, I'm fine. Fine, Buffkin. Thanks for asking. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. Oh man, I wish yeah, there was any more specific. I wish I told you to fuck off, though. <laughs> Be back in a few minutes. He knows the ones I'm talking about. There's you know, like, to be information on her so here. these are mostly mm -hmm. like you know the usual. We'll at least be able to get her so real name that. from the books whenever Buff can find them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. Okay, really sure. You really have to get this appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. All right. So, anyways, guys, uh, for you all thinking of the fable, so it's mostly like our, you know, our, you know, our characters like Arrow, Donkey Skin. If I, I haven't read that story when I was young before, so yeah. So as you can see, it's like some genie and all. Try. <laughs> then the magic mirror also as well, and you can see from that, Big Bad Wolf. You know. Those that magic mirror. Oh, oh, got a question. You know the rule. I don't have time for this shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel, but have some respect for our history and rules. <sighs> mirror, mirror. Uh, if you're able, tell me all about this fable. See, was that so hard? Yeah, I'm about two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. <laughs> There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? 
Uh, let me see. Woodsman. Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. All right then. Uh, let's ch check on this guy. Well, what the fuck the is he doing? Hey, put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. <laughs> Classic drunkard. Show me Snow White. The usual. Not much of a request. She's in this very room. I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. All right, then. Nobody right now. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else. Or someone new. Well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. Wow, <laughs> didn't expect you can actually do a reflection in the mirror itself in since 2013. Alright guys, I'm so sorry. Way out of my leave from that. <laughs> okay, uh... Oh, let's get a sec. Director of Operations Assistant. Damn. Okay... Yeah, let's check the... Uh, yeah, let's check this we'll shit start out. start with these. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. Indefinitely. I see bees. Beauty. Beauty and the Beast. Hmm. I think her name was Red. She didn't make it out. And the Woodsman. Red Riding Hood's knight in shabby armor. <laughs> the Woodsman? Yep. And his axe. And it's a. There's me. What a good day. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be me. Indeed. Yeah, dwarves. The less said about that, the better. Them. Ah, happier times. Colin and his brothers. I've seen this before. This symbol on the man's clothes, it's the same as the rings. Could be her father. Or husband. This has most of the emblems of the old days, and usually what family they come from. If it's in here, we'll have her name. We'll see about that. But I'll check out the thing of it. Ichabod Crane. Ichabod Crane. Scared shitless. You know What's the that? Your boss. His finest moment. A pussy. The usual. Hard to understand how he ended up running this place. Well. Maybe it's time that changed. I haven't seen Badger around for a while. He likes his privacy, I think. I wish Toad would like his a bit more. And Toad. Oh, <laughs> Alright, let me back up. Uh, let's search the book and find uh, that girl itself. Oh. Cinderella, that's what we see. Let's turn our pages. There yeah, it is. Great. What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. Don't overdo it. <laughs> this is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alelairo? I'll go look it up. Alelairo. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? <sighs> donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin, <laughs> also known as <laughs> ass skin, <laughs> uh, prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. 
The story of Donkey Skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Uh, his daughter, Faith. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. No. I don't really know about that story. Maybe you can search I it up later. Mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. Damn. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we came for. Yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than we... name was Faith. Yeah. We should talk to the husband. You think he did it? Our Nothing remote. would surprise me at this point. We can't rule him out. Isn't that agreeable? Uh, all right, let's give me a sec. Let's ask him for a while. Mirror, mirror, blah blah, able, blah 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 about this fable. Of which fable do you wish to know? Uh, faith. Show me. Show me faith. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. Shit. These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, baby. It's simply the way this has to be. Show me Faith's father, the old king. Damn. He's already dead. Guess that crosses him off the suspect list. What about Prince Lawrence? He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. What's he been doing? Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. All right, let's get there. Nobody right now. Anything we can use? Yeah, that'll have to do for now. Come on, we're going over there. Sorry, I have to get that. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I... He is. Hold on. Bigby, it's for you. Bigby! It's me, Doug. You there? What do you want? Big, big shit. It's all right. There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Get over here, Big, big, before he... Oh, wait, hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! What was that about? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble, and we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Whenever you're ready. Indeed. All right, guys. Uh, I think I'll stop the video right here. Uh, if you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe. And I hope you're enjoying this series as much as I do and giving a lot of nostalgia to it. And I'll see you all in the next one.